In science fiction, there weren't many women writing it in the early years, but in the early 80s, late 70s, female writers became really active in the field and started winning a lot of awards. Since I've been in science fiction for the last 30 years or so, I think more and more women are coming into the field of science fiction. Fantasy, they've always been in. In Octavius Butler's works, the world looked like the world that I actually saw around me, a realistic experience of a female character in a diverse and complex world. She did speak a lot to issues of uh, gender fluidity, um, for example, in the Xenogenesis Lilith's Brood books. She spoke a lot to issues of women trying to lead and dealing with overt sexism and subtle sexism. I'm a feminist and have always, you know, felt that I was a feminist. It's never something I felt that I should be or anyone should be ashamed of. I just wanted to have very strong female characters. I just felt like this is the way the world should be. As far as role models go, uh, you know, mom is the first one. My mother grew up on a farm. They were uh, very poor for the, the early years. She was the first child in her family to go to college and graduated in math and engineering and got a job. In a lot of ways, I was a generation ahead of my generation because I had a working mother when everybody else's mother was staying home. 